Oh, this evening, a lot of residents say they're afraid of what's in the water. Comanche National Tribal members accusing the city of dumping solid, untreated waste into their waters. Video of that meeting going viral on TikTok. News Force Kaylee Olivas is there tonight to get to the bottom of it. This is East Cache Creek. It connects to Nine Mile Creek a couple miles away where the city of Lawton admits it's discharging waste that's not fully up to state compliance. All tribal members like kind of hold in common is that we believe that water is life, so we will do anything to protect it. Concerns are washing through the city of Lawton after the Comanche Nation brought to light reports of untreated solid waste being dumped into nearby creeks. Quote, it's destroying that watershed and damaging Comanche waters, a Comanche tribal member said last week. A Comanche Tribal Office of Environmental Programs representative said there are reports of East Cache Creek being black and having more than 2,000 contamination counts of E. coli. You have um, organic matter decomposing, it can turn it green, it can turn it black. So I think that that's some of it. Um, and um, I think the other part of it is we know that um, some of the water that we're discharging doesn't meet DEQ standards. So. Um, I, I'm not going to sit here and, and tell you that what we're doing is perfect because it isn't. The city of Lawton unfortunately has a two decade long track record of not following state regulations when it comes to wastewater. It's currently under a quote consent decree for non-compliance, meaning it needs to make upgrades to its wastewater treatment plant, but that project won't be finished until the summer of 2025. I don't believe it's going to be 15 months. Under state regulations, the city does not have to test the water for E. coli from October through May. But bioaquatic testing done by the city in February show there is no harm being done to marine life or humans. However, residents collected their own samples, those results coming back Tuesday, showing dangerously high levels of E. coli. In fairness, that's 25 miles long. There's other people discharging into the creek. There's no such thing as a soft, safe waste. Waste is a waste any way you look at it. And I'm concerned that it's going to ruin our water system. The city of Lawton says with these concerns, it plans to do more E. coli testing. But after several complaints, DEQ says it's already investigating and could issue an additional enforcement order. I would hope that this would cause DEQ to really take a look at themselves and to wonder, um, you know, how they could improve in that area. In Lawton, Kaylee Olivas, Oklahoma's News 4. All right, Kaylee, thank you. As of this month, the upgrades to the wastewater treatment plant are 40 percent complete. We've reached out to the Comanche Nation for more information, but the tribe declined to comment.